Welcome back to another edition of the Prospect Profile, a mini-series we do here within the Kansas City Royals franchise where we go over top prospects from AA Northwest Arkansas up to AAA Omaha. Last time we went over AA catching prospect Maybreeze Valoria. Now we're going to be heading back up to AAA in Omaha to go over outfield slash first baseman slash DH prospect Vince Falvey. Like I said, Falvey is an outfielder, also can play first base, but he is more suited as a DH, as we will get on into later in the episode. He is a left-handed bat, left-handed throw. He stands six foot four, 224 pounds. He is quite ripped. He is from New York State, and he is 22 years old. Falvey is one of those guys who a CPU team drafted and then just didn't sign, so he was in the free agency. Him and Richard Rose are the two guys that that I signed who are that type of player in this past offseason. Taking a look at Falvey's attributes, he's currently a 72 overall C potential, so the guy's not going to get insanely better, but he doesn't really need to because he's already quite good, especially at the plate. That is his bread and butter. The guy absolutely mashes, especially against right-handed pitching. He has a 73 contact, 61 power versus righties, and then against lefties it drops down to 65 contact and 45 power. Still pretty darn good, but not quite what it is against right-handed pitching, as he is a left-handed bat, so that does make sense. He also has great plate skills, as you guys are sure you're aware of what I call plate skills is plate vision and plate discipline. So he's able to get his bat on the ball with the vision, and then he's also going to be able to draw quite a few walks, have quite a high OBP, as well as hitting quite a few homers and hitting for a high average with that discipline. Falvey is also very durable. You don't have to worry about him getting hurt left and right, not being in the lineup when you need him to be. He's got 83 durability, so he's not an injury-prone player. And he even has good speed, or should I say nice speed. 69 speed, 55 stealing, 53 base running aggression. I would say it's not out of his reach to be like a 20 home run, 20 steal type player. I would say he could probably hit 30 home runs in the major leagues, but I don't, I'm not sure if I would say he could steal 30 bags. That's probably being a bit generous for his speed, but I mean, hey, it's possible. He could shoot forward eventually in his career, being a 30 home run, 30 stolen base type player. And so far, this guy seems like he was just descended from the heavens to be a great baseball player. But then you look at his fielding, and the guy can't feel whatsoever. He's got 42 fielding, 44 reactions, so those are just not good at all. He's got a decent arm, he's got 55 arm strength, 72 accuracy, so he's able to get it where it needs to be. Not the fastest throws, though, but he just can't feel. He can't get the balls, he can't catch balls consistently. He's not, he's not built to be an outfielder. He's built to either like be a first baseman or a DH, but he's even then not going to be like a Mark Teixeira out there scooping things and making diving plays over at first base. He's more of like a kind of like a Hanley Ramirez first base where he just kind of plays there because that's really all you can put him. So Vince Valvey definitely has quite a bright future as a bat in the Major League level. He even could be a solid bat at the Major League level right now. It's just he's never going to be a guy who's going to be a goal glover for you or even like a serviceable fielder. He's going to be a DH and if maybe if he's in the National League you put him at first base or obviously if he's in the National League you put him at first base but in our case he is a DH. He's not going to be a guy who you throw in and if you're the Red Sox he's not going to be a guy you throw in right field and expect him to cover right field at Fenway. He's not going to be able to do that. He's not going to be able to even cover right field anywhere really. So Falvey his future is as a DH but it could be a bright future as a DH. We do have Tommy Joseph on the team right now. Falvey is only 22 years old. I wouldn't say he's going to be up in the majors this year, but it's definitely possible he could be next year or the year after that. He's definitely in our plans. He's not going to have the highest trade value though because he is only a C potential, so he is there for us to use if we ever need him or if we ever want him on our everyday lineup because I don't think I would want to call him up as a bench player because I prefer to have utility guys and guys who can actually play the field on the bench. So Falvey, he's going to be in trip AAA just down there mashing, working on his craft, getting ready for his opportunity in the big leagues. So with that being said, that's going to wrap things up here for this edition of the Prospect Profile. Vince Falvey, outfield slash DH slash first base prospect in AAA Omaha. I've been your host, Jersey Born, and I'm saying goodbye. Some loving had me a blast.